Jason is in prison in Iran, in the Evan prison, for the crime of, let me quote directly, collecting information about internal and foreign policy, close quote. That is also known as practicing journalism. On the night of Tuesday, July 22nd, my son Jason Rezaian and his wife Yegane Salahi were both arrested in Iran. There's been no evidence actually provided by the Iranian government that he engaged in espionage or did anything other than actually report on what was happening in that country. For 10 months, he's been locked up essentially by himself. Uh, you know, for months and months, he wasn't treated for several infections. He's had problems with his back because he's been sleeping on the floor, uh, on a concrete floor. Jason has been imprisoned in Tehran for nothing more than writing about the hopes and the fears of the Iranian people. Jason's brother Ali is here tonight, and uh, I have told him personally we will not rest until we bring him home to his family, safe and sound. <laughs> This is one of the rare stories where the entire journalistic establishment is all lined up trying to get Jason free. We're joined today by people from change.org. Everybody who can hear my voice, please go to change.org and add your name because we believe this will make a difference. We wouldn't be doing this if we didn't think this would make a difference. We know Jason did nothing wrong. We know that Jason's instincts and his intentions about living in Iran and reporting about Iran were the best intentions. That's what's been attacked. So please take a minute to sign that petition. Thank you very much.